Hello everyone. Welcome to the stream. Welcome back to Dyson Sphere Program. Hey Technicolor Ghost. Welcome. It is Dyson Satisfactorio. How did you guess? Dyson Satisfactorio with a PH. It says Factorio with a PH, just, just for differences. So uh, we're going to uh, jump in and uh, figure out what we want to do next. Uh, I was thinking somewhere between either the uh, uh, f going to the next system to colonize. I think there was another system that had stuff that we still needed. Um, and then the other option is to take a look at green science cubes, green matrix cubes. So this is where we left off kind of last time. We, we did this priority uh, merger here with the splitter, making sure that we get the uh, organic crystals from space before we get the organic crystals from manufacturing. We did the same kind of thing over here with um, hydrogen, where we have a priority input from the uh, manufacturer, the hydrogen being manufactured with the oil, before the hydrogen coming in from the orbital collectors at the gas giant, which is here. Um, and we probably have a crap ton of that stored up there now because we just started collecting it, which is fine. We will have all the hydrogens. And then, you know what I probably should have done, speaking of that with the hydrogens? I probably should have um, kept a tank in here as a buffer for this. And then had the splitter after the tank. Oh well, we'll fix it later if we need to. Hopefully it won't be a problem. As long as we continue to make deuterium, it won't be a problem. Oh, you're uh, you're still catching up. Yeah, we're at... Uh, what is this? What episode is this one? I didn't even look. This is going to be 26. So... Yeah, you're, you're a couple behind, but it's okay. Um, I played for three times a week for a while, and now the last several weeks I've been down to just two times a week, with uh, Eco taking the third spot, and then, of course, f uh, Satisfactory taking the uh, the Sunday Co-op shenanigans slot. Which reminds me, uh, this week may be a little um, different on the, um, on the streaming front. I may not have all of my streams this week. Uh, Thursday and Saturday are both going to be tougher days for me to stream. Uh, I may be able to pull it off. I may not. Um, so I'm planning... Actually, I almost certainly won't stream on Thursday. So I'm planning on makeup stream for that on Friday. Um, and there's a special... Um, special event planned on Friday, along with the, uh, the usual... Most likely the usual eco stream on Friday. Um, there's another special event planned that I I don't want to t to tell beforehand. Okay, so for these green cubes, we need graviton lenses, which we are making, I believe. Yes, we are. Wait a minute. So one graviton lens makes one space warper. One graviton lens makes two green cubes, along with a quantum chip. Uh, one cube makes eight warpers. Well, that's a horse of a different color. So we're already making the graviton lenses, so that's easy mode. And we do eventually want to have um, the other recipe for graviton lenses, which we don't have available to us yet. But that is um, used using... Or no, it's these that have the alternate? Who has the alternate recipe for uh, using the stuff from the black hole? I don't know. That's antimatter, artificial stars. Uh huh. We're actually kind of almost done with tech, but uh, let's see. Hum. And the other option is to go. Yeah, 
that's, the, that's kind of the problem I'm having is, is balancing all the things. The other option is to go to, let's see, we are, Rook was a little bit far at seven light years. Uh, Gamma Loopy has Kimberlite. That's what we were looking at possibly going to mine. Ah, we just finished the, um, the, uh, uh Assembly Machine Mark III, which also increases our personal replicator's production speed by another 50%. Uh, this planet is five away, but nothing we don't already have. We're already here at Theta Circini, with a lot of stuff. Seleno has the same kind of stuff. Who else is close? You? Eta Reticuli has optical grading crystals. Which I think we need to make the, um... I think those are make... Yes, those make these. And we're going to need these now. So that might be a, not a bad idea to go to Eta Reticuli. I... They were talking about a roadmap, but then they... I don't think they ever actually released it. Yeah, so let's look at what these quantum chips are going to cost. Maybe we'll go to that other system. So, we start out with processors. We have those being made somewhere. Then we need the plane filters, which need these crystals. And instead, I think, of trying to do the titanium crystals, I think we could go and get the uh, these fancy crystals here to make the Casimir crystals, since we have them available to us. That is the right thing, right? Optical grading crystal, yes. And then... Titanium glass, which is glass. Shocking. Titanium and water. Oof. Why you hurt me? Yeah. So the problem with water is... We're making titanium. Uh, here. A Kappa Columbia 1. Um, we have some glass getting made there also, but we only have 800,000 stone left. Whereas here at home... No. Ah. Here at home, we have 5 million stone left. So, I think I might make that titanium glass here at home um, by just shipping the titanium over, which we're already doing, and making more glass locally here and then we obviously have water here so i think that makes more sense and then those crystals will go into uh or the, then that titanium glass will go into into with these crystals which we can ship over we have plenty of hydrogen coming in here now we have graphene being made here somewhere don't we where are we making graphene this is this is graphene. We're making a crap ton of graphene here with fire ice, so I think that makes the most sense to do this stuff here. Hey, Roadster. Welcome. I am not yet making a Dyson Sphere. What I have is, if I press the right button, a Dyson Swarm. Thanks for the raid, Roadster. A, a roadster, uh, a roadster. Uh, a Dyson Swarm is a ring of satellites uh, that can um, provide a lot of power to your system just by filling up the satellites. Uh, we have. Can't look at it that way. We have. I can't remember how many satellites we have in that, but it's a lot. Uh, where is my one launcher on this planet? Over there. By the charging station. Where it belongs. Don't ask me why. But that's what I just said. Uh, let's see. We have... Oh, wait. No. Duh. Nope. Not that. Nice and sphere. 21,000-ish. So, um, we're doing pretty well. I think we probably can put down more, um, more ray receivers now. Because we have quite a bit of, uh, of sat satellites now. But not right now. Not just yet. Okay, so if we make these and then we make this, we make this, then we make the quantum chips, which need the processors. But we're making the gonna if we make the plane filters here, 
then I'll probably just keep shipping processors here because we're doing it anyway and just make the uh, quantum chips here and then we need the graviton lenses though that are at the other planet so maybe hmm we either have to ship them over here which we could do or we could just ship hmm I think I want to ship the quantum chips back over to the forge world no no changes yet roasters really just a couple of kill well like bug fixy kind of things but that's it if we send the quantum chips back over uh, to the or the sorry the the plane filters back over to the other world we can make the quantum chips locally there we can take the graviton lenses that we're making aphasian that we're making from the um that we're making right now to make the warpers and instead repurpose them to make green cubes mix in the quantum chips that we are making and then make the green cubes we can remake warpers then from the green cubes and ship the rest of the green cubes over here uh, to make the um, to make the sciences to do the researches. So I think that's a plan. So in order to accomplish that plan, we need to have a crap ton of fusion power. Um, do we have any of these? No. And then we need some more blue engines. Good guess there. I just want like a couple hundred of these. About that many. And then... Where do I have... Do I... I think I have... The, uh... Yeah, I do. They're over there, I think. Okay, fly, will you? That was too many blue engines, by the way. Yes, here we are. Uh, let's bring more of these in. You know what? Let's bring all the things in. Why not? Talked about oh, except for except for you. Well, too late now. Uh, oops. We talked about that before, and just just letting it fill up. Who cares? Kind of thing. Uh, these we needed a, a few of these. Make two more. Uh, we'll bring in the Deuteron. Uh, we need some more. Interplanetary stations, I think. Which I have here. Another stack would do. Actually, I'll just take a full stack. Let's do some planetary stations, too, while we're at it. Just to have them. And we have plenty of boats here. Uh, we could get rid of this hydrogen. Uh, I could just burn the hydrogen, for that matter. Just burn it. And then before we go, that doesn't help me any. Give me just a few of these, maybe. I guess that's all I can have here. Jesus, phasing. And I think we will, um, I think we'll be ready to move on. Just to move out, I mean. So the planet we wanted to go to was, oops, was not Theta Cirquini. We're already there. It's one of these. Gamma Loopy? Yes, Gamma Loopy. Let's uh, pin this so we always see it. And then let's see if we can find our way there. I think I have enough stuff. I have enough miners. No, let's get some more, more miners. And how are we doing on belt? That would be a good thing to have. One, two... Th Let's get a little more belt. Where's the miners at? Whoa, learn how to fly. Another stack of miners. And belt. A couple of those sorters. We probably don't need very many sorters. Uh, but we're doing fine on sorters. Close, but uh, not quite. I do sometimes slip in a Canadian word. Uh, Gamma Loopy, is that where we're going? Uh, I guess word would be the way to the way to word it. Huh. 
Uh, let's see. Yes, Kimberlite at Gamma Loopy. Okay. And as soon as we get out of the gravitational zone of that uh, gas giant. We're still in the gravitational pull. There we go. Warp speed. Where did those Deuteron cells go? Whoa. Don't lose. Went too far. Let's see where we're at here. Oh, there's only one planet here? Oh, that's great. Only one here. It's a barren desert. Um... No wind, and barely any sun, but we do get fire ice and kimberlite here, so I'm not sure how you get fire ice in a desert, but it is not mine to judge. Now, where's that planet at? There it is. All right. One AU, we'll just fly there. We got enough power to get there, I think. Well, we have enough power to get there, no matter what. I moved to Canada, huh? That's, um... That'd be a good adventure. Okay, so there's stone here. What else is there here, by the way? Lots of stone. We could freaking make glass here, or at least mine the stone to make the glass from here. That's an option, at least for later when we run out of glass on the um, on the forge world, or our stone rather. Uh, that's definitely an option. There's kimberlite over there. That's eight hundred ninety-seven. That's all we have is one node. Okay, let's go find it. That's true, except that it doesn't really matter. Uh, there's, there's the Kimberlite. I do want to set up my power station on the equator someplace, though. So we'll go right here where there's a uh, Meridian. And we can do our planet interplanetary, or interstellar, or whatever it's called. Intergalactic planetary. Planetary Intergalactic. So this is basically like Earth's moon, I suppose. In terms of the appearance. Uh, we want space warpers to come in here. Uh, just a hundred. Let's uh, remote demand. And we'll do local supply on those. That way we only have to have one ship bringing them in. Which one? The moon thing or the intergalactic planetary thing? And then we're also going to want uh, Deuteron fuel cells here. Um, and we're just going to do remote demand on that as well. But I think I will wait until... Oh, wait, we can do it now. Yeah, remote demand. And then we can do a belt for those here and here. And then uh, fusion power. One, two, three, four. One. Wait a minute. Did I screw that one up? I think I did. Get out of there. Yeah. One, two, three, four. <laughs> old school beats. Okay, so I have somewhere in my inventory some of these, but we're going to go ahead and pick these up anyway. Um, actually, what I'm going to do is put as many as I can in my inventory here, and then I will dump the rest of these into one of these after I put down the sorters. Is 
Zippity doo, zippity doo. I suppose I should potentially just delete this extra belt here and dump those into, excuse me, into here. And then you can have some, and you can have some. There you go. And we are juiced. Okay, power hole. Right there-ish. Put down the sorters. And then we're going over there someplace, wasn't it? Yeah, right up there. Um, yeah, that's fine. Here. At least this is a decent sized patch. I'll wait for that last one. Miners. That's a good spot. The uh, funny thing, Fazian, if, if it's not the same for you, is I was... Uh, I was thinking the Weird Al version. Not the actual version. Because, well, you know me. It's about as many as I can reasonably get, though. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, and then we want another interplanetary station here. Just because I don't want to schlep it all the way over there to just descend it, so... We'll just do this here. I guess that's fine. And then a belt. Um, let's see, we'll come out this way. Nope, we gotta go one more. Back this way and into there. And then you can come out like this, I guess. This one goes this way. And there. So we'll have three on one and four on the other. I assume that'll be okay. Go there. This and this. And then you're going to accept Kimberlite, which is. Wait, is this Kimberlite? It is Kimberlite. Wait a minute. This isn't the right thing. What did I think I was getting? Oops, I think we went to the wrong system. This is Kimberlite, which is the stuff you make diamonds out of. Not the stuff you make, oops, optical grading crystals out of. But we could use this anyway. Uh, and we should use this anyway. So I'm going to go ahead and set it up. Uh, let's do... Let's do warpers here. 100. And we'll do a local demand remote storage. Uh, we'll drop some of these in here. Those in there. And they'll bring them over from there quickly. And then we'll have Kimberlite that we can use for God knows what. Now that we've done that... Now we need to find out where we're supposed to be. And that's half of what I need. Uh, where were we supposed to go? We're looking for... This is going to be tough now because we're further away. So if we guess at ocean would be good. Um... Spiniform stalagmite? No, that wasn't it. What was it we were looking for? Right button. Optical grading crystal.
Okay, I have no idea where it was. We might have to go back to the home system to, to, to find it. Because we might not be able to see from here. But I want to do one more thing before we leave here. I want to put down a charging station, even though I don't need it anymore. Uh, this visit, I want to have it for next visit. So we'll come back. We always come back. We'll use this stuff, and we might pick some other stuff up here eventually. Because why not, right? Okay, we burned through a little bit, but not very much. Uh, so let's head home, I guess. If I can find where home is. There we are. There's a warper. See the warping? Anybody remember the name of the planet we were, or the system we were going to go to? Okay, Capricorn Bay 2, 3, 3. You think I know that by now, but apparently I do not. Oh, we just warped through the sun. Okay, I'm just going to stay... No, I better not. I better land and charge. If I can find... There it is. Okay, we left Gamma Lupe. Optical grading crystals while we charge up. Where are they? Not Seleno. Cabot Corvi's too far, so it wasn't that. Ada Reticuli was where it was. Too far away. What else we might we have? What else might we have? It's six light years, Shara. That's got a sulfuric acid ocean. That's not a bad deal. It's too far. That's way too far. I'm not going to try to pronounce that one. Keep clicking on the same worlds. And I like that our black hole is only 16 light years away too. That's that's a dumb luck out of this seed. Too far. Okay. It was Ada Reticuli. Oh, wait. We need to make some stuffs and things. Some uh, fusion plants. Yes, they do. I don't know if they if they have like a random li randomized list of uh, planets that they're or like systems that they're looping through or how this works. But yeah, a lot of them do look and sound like uh, actual planet names. There we are. So I'm in, oh, that's way too many of those. I guess we're getting that many now. And then blue engines. The problem with the 10,000 thing is that now we have too many. I don't remember how many that was. Uh, where are they? How do you not have any? Because I've sent them all that way. Yeah, we're still starving out on... Why are we still starving out? Hydrogen? Wait a damn minute. Wait, that's deuterium. We're still not making enough deuterium. That is obscene. Uh, 
And that includes shipping deuterium in from that planet in that other system, too. I do have warpers in here, right? Yes. Okay. That's insane. I guess I'm going to have to do uh, another one of those to make this work. Okay, where were we at with these uh, power buildings? 14. Two more. Okay, and... Well, that helps. When one of those ships arrived, it arrives, it sure does help fill it up. We may not be mining enough deuterium at that planet either. We may have to go out with some more, um, some more, uh, whatchamacallits, uh, orbital stations at some point. What do those cost to make? The reinforced thrusters and the full accumulators. We happen to have those things. We could make some and... and no, because that's over at... It's over in the other direction, I think. Yeah, kind of. In the opposite kind of in the opposite direction. So let's just go to Ada Reticuli and see what we can see what kind of trouble we can cause over there. Kappa four. Ada Reticuli. Still in the gravitational pole. Oh! Nope. We need to dump some more warpers in. We've already burned through 20 warpers. I mean, it's been a few episodes, but still. Yeah, they sound... They, it's like they pulled a list of... They pulled a list of real real systems or, or you know, whatever, and are just pulling a random, randomized list, a randomized selection from that list. Reticuli one and two. So two is that way a bit, and one is I just saw it. Over th no. Right there. So let's point in that direction, at least for now. Uh, and see what's there. That's the fire ice. Okay, well, we don't want that one. Well, we do, but not right now. So this is the one we want. Ada Reticuli 2. And it's an ice field jelly soul. And now we've got to try and find it. Narf. Hey, Esco. Welcome. Behind me over here someplace. Um. Am I being thick? There it is. Oh, nice. Thanks for the lurk. We are trying to get optical grading crystals for the second time because I went to the wrong place. Slam. Okay. And uh, that way we can start working on green science cubes. And we want optical grading crystals. Optical. There's one million there, and that's all there are. Yippee. Okay. So maybe we go into this area here someplace.
to establish a um, power plant. Here's the equator. Okay, we'll go just a little bit more. Does anybody see a meridian? It's fractal silicon too, that'll be useful. Ah, uh, here's a meridian right here. Is that a good place? Yeah, it's good enough. There. And then set up our demands just like before. Uh, we need to have Deuteron fuel cells. You know, I requested 10,000 of those at the last planet. That's why we drained all of it. Maybe I shouldn't request that many. I should just do like 2,000. Remote demand, local supply, yes. Uh, let's do warpers here, tiny amounts. Remote demand, local supply, yes. These and these. And then, belt. Oops, I forgot to set the filter. Why is it not showing me the filter thingy? Just do it that way. And then uh, power. All of this power is, of course, overkill for these planets, but it'll only get used when it needs to get used, so why the heck not? I need to go a little bit longer on this belt. Yeah, dang it. I drained it. That was dumb. That was super dumb. So how far is this planet from the one that we just did? Very far. What does the indicator do? Oh, that's what the indicator does. Okay, that's useful you which way you're trying to go. I need to use that more often. So while we're waiting for fuel here, which may never come, let's go ahead and put down a power pole here to charge that up when it's time. And then we can go up here to the optical grading crystal and start laying out a mine here. That looks painful. Not very much. Not very much at all. I think we're going to do the more miners with fewer nodes rather than uh, fewer miners with more nodes option. It's not too far. And hey, Galadarn, thank you for the raid. Hey, Glass Deviant. Welcome. Thank you for the follow as well. 
One, two, three, four, seven. Okay. I'm not gonna swing the. No, you're not doing that. Get out of there. Hello. That way? Yes, that way. And thank you, Addicted to Capping, for the follow. Yeah, well, yeah. It's Dyson Sphere, so... It'll be confusing only until you figure out that I'm doing something uh, insane, and then you go from there. It happens. Can I? Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Okay, so we get any fuel yet? No. Doggone it, you dummy. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I really shouldn't have done that. Well, the only recourse we have now, I suppose, is to go there and fix it. Which was Gamma Loopy, which is six light years away from here. Which is a pain, but we're going to have to do it, I think. Come on, gravitational field. Thank you for letting go. <clears throat> nope. Not yet. Now we can go. I don't know, can we go six light years yet on uh, one warp? Guess we're going to find out. Good thing we have a charging station there. Oh, yeah, I think we'll make it. Barely, but we'll make it. At least there's only one planet. We don't have to try and figure out where we're going. And there it is. Oh, we dropped out just before we got there. Doggone it. We're 5 AU away with no, no juice. Oof. Well, we're going to take the slow boat, guys. So I made an announcement at the beginning of the stream, and I will I will remake it now, um, since there are a few more people here. Uh, I normally stream on Thursdays, for those of you who are new to the channel, uh, but this Thursday is almost certainly not going to happen going to be able to happen so i'm going to push it till friday again but the friday stream should have a uh interesting surprise that comes comes with it um so uh show up tune in for that at the uh, usual time uh, 9 30 eastern time so about 45 minutes ago and three days from now and then the saturday stream may also not be able to happen um or it may be shorter um, I guess I should be using the thruster here to pick up some speed. Um, so keep an eye out on my, my channel for that. Uh, and I'll make an announcement in my Discord uh, for sure. But I... Yeah, same Wally time, same Wally channel. I, um, I just don't know if I'll be able to uh, stream for very long, if at all, on Saturday. And Thursday, like I said, is pretty much out. So, But, but watch for a stream for Friday... And um, and then we will uh, we'll have a little surprise there, hopefully. How much power do you need to have to warp? Obviously more than I do have. Um, maybe I shouldn't have used the thruster again and should have just waited until I had enough power to warp. Does anybody know how much power you need to have to warp? Kaladarm probably does. 400-ish? Okay, we'll wait till we get to 400 and then maybe I'll... Maybe I'll, um... Try it again there. Oh, there's a, there's a butt there, though. That's just to start the thing. Yeah, so... 
I probably should wait till I get to five or six hundred to, to even try it. We only have three more AU to go. I could just wait it out and, and use the thruster. But... Yeah. Alright, let's try it again. Stupid you can't, like, freaking coast. That would be nice. Oh, that's perfect. It fell right out right there. That's how I land. What are you gods knowing? Let's turn that down. Turn that crap down. We'll just do 2,000. And then I'm going to take a bunch of this with me. Like, a bunch of? As much as I can carry. Um... Apparently I'm going to take it all with me because I can't put it back in because I, well, yeah, let's do this. Let's, let's carry it in our hand because we can do that because this is real science. And let's swing by home, which is somewhere in this general direction. There it is. Oh, yeah, the thruster for 4AU is just, yeah, it's a problem. So we'll go home and drop this into the station that's distributing these things. And then we'll take what we have back with us to... Or actually, probably just drop it all here. That's probably the easier option. Instead of going all the way back out there. No, I have to go back out there anyway. I can't see, though, behind my cursor thing here. Yeah, that's pretty good. Perfect landing. Don't tell anybody otherwise. Still got 5,000, almost 6,000 uh, Deuteron fuel rods in my hand. That's how strong my mech hands are. And we wait for charging. We'll use a few there. Okay. Now we can go put these in that station. Uh, this one? This one. Nice. And I think... Yeah, all of you can just go as well. You might as well. Why are you not getting any of it, though? Oh, that's why. Okay, let's take a few of you, then. Put them in here. And hopefully... Yeah, hopefully. Let's go back to... Where the heck were we? Let's use the feature here that I just learned about. Uh, Eight of reticuli. Indicate. Hey, look. It's got a line. Oh, we even have navigational data here. Nice. Girl Dulu playing Little Misfortune. Hey, was it? Have you have you played yet, or since Calendar, and since they added this feature? Because yeah, that's about the only new feature that I can really think of. Uh, that uh, is kind of standing out. I think they added it in that post, um... Where the hell were we going? We were going to... Two? Now I've forgotten. Yep, we're going to two. 
And I'm gonna have to use the uh, thruster again. Okay, we don't need the we don't need the arrow anymore. Thank you. I'm gonna have to use the warp again. Dang it. I pulled out too early. Mm-hmm. Boom. Like that. All right, now we should hopefully have, we do have. Excellent. Zip de doo. And there. Oh, I should have done this first. Yes. And then this later. And then technically that should have even gone later, but it's fine. It's fine, it's fine. Let's put down a charging station here. Do, 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 do. What are you sighing about? You went in a coal-powered mech? That's just asking for trouble. Ah, uh, yes. That that would be a sigh-worthy sigh comment. Alright, so we have fuel here. We have uh, warpers here. We have not stuff getting mined because I didn't go... I didn't finish setting it up yet. But that's fine. We have purple stuff. That's good. So I want to have... I didn't bring any warping ships. Crap. Um. <sighs> Dang it. How did I not have enough? I'm gonna put them in here instead. And uh, we'll get the uh, warpers. Uh, local, local demand. Oh, wait, 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 turn it down. Local demand. And then we'll do optical grading crystal. And we'll just go to town on that. So I'd rather have the the warp capable logistics vessels here, uh, where we're gonna be hauling a bunch of stuff, as opposed to here where it's just fuel coming in and warpers coming in every so often. And then I think we can go back home, right? And start working on these. So the plan... Oh, they didn't leaf or wood-powered mech. That's just insane. The plan now is, if I can find the right screen, we're working towards green cubes. So uh, we have these already being made in some quantity that I don't remember, but that's fine. Uh, we're going to make quantum chips on the, on the lava world. Uh, we already have processors there. We're going to make plane filters, though, on the uh, on the Earth-like world, I think. Because we need to make the titanium glass someplace, and we're running low on stone at the uh, lava world, and we also don't have any water there. So I think we're going to make titanium glass on the, on the, uh, the Earth-like world, and then we're going to just continue to... We're going to bring these in? Well, yes. We'll bring these crystals into the, also the same place. And make these. And then we'll ship those out to... Uh, to the lava world to... Make quantum chips to then make green cubes. And we'll pull the graviton lenses off of making warpers to make green cubes. And instead make warpers from green cubes because it's more efficient, way more efficient. So let's head back home.
which is that way. Still in gravitational range. Hey, future boy, welcome back. And I think I'm going to go to the uh, Lava World first. So that's uh, Cavaclone Bay 1. And we just ran out of juice. Great. Oops, wrong button. <laughs> All right, uh, let's see. In this disaster area, we have One, two, three, four, five, six, nine, twelve graviton lens makers. Which is like two? Yeah, that's that's two per second. That's what we call high quality there. Um so if we look at the recipe again. For making two of these, we're going to get four of these per second, which is good because we're going to spend some of them on orpers anyway, and we're only making two science per second right now, so that's fine. Um, so if we need to have, if we have two of these that we're going to use, we need to have two quantum chips. Two quantum chips means four plane filters. Four plane filters means eight titanium glass and four casimir crystals. Well, I asked for suggestions on rewards. What would you like me to reward? And I had to burn 2,000 just to see Gizmo the other day because I had so many. Well, a Ferrari might be a lot of meteors, meteorites, like, I don't know, a few million, maybe? Probably more? Probably more. Okay, so, let's see, if we do... Are we out of... I think we are. Okay, we're just about out of coal. Wasn't I bringing in... Robot on cam? Well. Might be a little tough to do. For multiple reasons. What was I going to do about this? By bringing in... Oh, that's why. Ha. Okay. I'm bringing in what I need for the uh, blue engines to the blue engine maker, but I'm not bringing in what I need for the 
diamonds. Well, I guess we could make the Kimberlite diamonds here now. Uh, very often. Or very enough here. But we could do uh, remote demand and get a few more. That is, that is for certain. I don't know about the sing a song. That's going to be a little tough given my stream time and, uh, uh, um, what, what the state of the house is at the time. Uh, do it might be fine, but I definitely need to have the same caveat as you have on yours. Okay, so, let's see, if we want to do four green science cubes, we already have the optical grading crystals done. So let's head back to the other planet and start setting up the other stuff. You're still pinned on this planet, huh? It doesn't clear the pin when you land? It seems like that would be a useful feature. I have no idea. It's probably a manual thing, yeah. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I think I've seen people mention it too, but I don't know how to do it. This finally drained out? Yes it did. Um, so, where do we want to set up this stuff? That's the big question. We're probably going to have to expand glass production. You could do it over there by the, uh... Kind of running out of... Decent land without landfilling like a crazy person, but I guess we can do that. Yeah, we could do it here. We're right next to the equator here anyways. Okay, so now what I wanted. So we need to bring in those optical grading crystals and make the pink crystals. Are those used in anything else? Apparently not. Okay, <laughs> future boy, thank you for redeeming first. Hydrogen's gonna be a problem though. I think, or maybe not. No, it's not gonna be a problem. We have plenty O hydrogen. Because we have... We have a whole gas giant full of hydrogen, or am I bringing that... I am bringing that in. We're making that into... We're bringing that in for... Where are we bringing that in at? Right here. I did this last time. Bringing in the hydrogen from the gas giant to come into here as overflow service if it's needed. Okay, so... Hydrogen's okay. So to set these up, we need to um, we need to make four per second of these. Okay, let's do a uh, station. No, we want. Wait, do we want? A, yeah, we want a inter interplanetary one. And let's just go possibly right there. 
Uh, so we need 16 assembly. Maybe I don't want to go there. No, I don't want to go there. I lied. We need 16 assemblers. So let's go here with it. And this is... Um, just punch the microphone. Sorry about that. These. And these. And these. What's the 105,934? <laughs> nice. Okay, this local demand the warpers. I forgot to get ships. Let's go get some uh, vessels. That really doesn't actually surprise me. Yeah. Well, um, Future Boy and I have had those conversations. All right, so let's see. We want assemblers. And these? So we need to have one and a half per second times 16. Well, how do I want to do this? Three items in, one item out. I think we're going to have to do two belts in the middle. All the emotes, yes. Even the good ones. Um, let's see. The most items are the hydrogen. So let's do the, let's do the crystals. Well, how do I want to do this? Let's put the input, the out, the belt of the Casimir crystals going back in and the graphene going out here in the center. I think that's the best way to do this. So we'll do graphene here. And then we'll do this belt this way. Um, here we'll do hydrogen. Duck on it. There. And then um, here we'll do these optical grading crystals. I should have made these closer. That's fine. Yeah, I'm too, um, I don't know, anal retentive, something, to, uh, to not do ratios. So that's four. We need 16 total, so we need to go out quite a bit more. We can do our sorters and do our copy, sort, paste, sort, copy, paste sorters with sorters, whatever. Take those two out, and let's do sorters. Uh, this one, and this one. Go in there. Go out there. Go out there. Go in there. Here and here. Seven. Did I make it? I 
made it. Thank you, Anonymous, for the gift to Glass Deviant. Do that and then if I did everything correctly I should be able to fire up the power here no nope, I'm gonna go here and here and then here and here okay let's see we need we need boats and ships. Uh, this is going to be remote demand. Local, I don't really care about. Uh, this should be local demand, remote storage. Local demand, remote storage. And then supply on those items. And is power suffering, or is it just... Yeah, a little bit. We'll have to deal with that eventually. So it's take a little bit. I guess I should have pulled these in earlier, because it's going to take a little bit for them to come in. Since they got a warp to get them. But that'll be fine. So while those are making, we can make the next item. And the next item is... These? Nope. Uh, this first. The titanium glass... So the titanium glass, we need to have two, 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 and two. It looks there's stuff already coming in. So if we start this one, we need to have, we're gonna need to have a lot of these. It's gonna be 20 of these. I think we'll go here with it. No, I should go further away. And I should landfill. I should also landfill underneath this for funsies. It's going like that. Okay, and I'll go ahead and do the charge up here because it's going to take a little while. And we can go ahead and put some ships in. And we can... Local demand those. Do I need it? Do I actually need an uh, interstellar one here? Probably not. But hey, who cares? So these are... We could demand our own titanium this way, I guess. Okay. Um, well, we luckily have some water right here. Like, like I planned it that way or something. Uh, but we need to do... Class. Titanium. And then titanium glass. Okay, so let's do one, two, three. Dang it. Let's go out a little bit more on the sides.
Hey, Jake, welcome. How are you this evening? And I think what I want to do with the water... Well, let's have a return belt this way. Do I have any water pumps on me? Am I even making... I don't think I even think I'm making those. We need to have... How much water? A lot. We have eight water pumps. Good thing we had eight, enough to make eight. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. How do I want to do this? Can I put them, like, right here and then actually do something with it? Maybe. Maybe I do. No, I don't. Want one more space of land. Why you don't like that spot? That's an interesting one. Well, okay, we're gonna go on either side of that spot then. Where you're perfectly fine with placing them. It's five, six, seven, eight. And then a belt can come along this way. And the first four can go to here and then turn like this. And then we can have another belt that goes along this way. And can turn around that way. I think that'll be okay. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Don't need that one. Okay. So, the reason I put the extra space there is so that I could fit power poles in here, and it looked like it worked. That's good. That's very good. Let's do a couple like that, though. I think that's fine. Gives me the water that I need. I'll go that way. Need another one of these on this side. Then we'll have our return belt going this way. Then we'll have our water belt coming this way. Because a water belt is a thing. And these actually need to go quite a bit further this way. Maybe right about to there. And I'm going to have water all over the place now. If I misestimated these... Let's go ahead and place down some foundation here. I have everything all over the place here. That's okay, because we can shred stuff in this game. We can destroy stuff in this game without any loss. Or any uh, issue. There's loss, I suppose. And I'm going to run out of sorters. And that's not the right direction, anyway. There, here and here, uh, input, 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 input. We'll get some more Mark III sorters before I run out and it complains. Okay, so we need 20 of these. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Could have done much worse. Usually do much worse. And 
then these can go and we'll just delete this stuff out of the inventory. Water is here. Delete key. All right, and that should do it. We now have titanium glass. So that's uh, not working. Oh, I screwed up something here. Wait a minute. Oh, this is supposed to be graphene. Oopsie. Can I jam these back in here or are they going to complain? I could do something like this to give myself a little bit of a buffer. Okay, now those are getting made. That's good. And these are getting made. That's good. And then we need to make... What's next? We may need more class, but we can figure that out maybe sometime later. We need to make these next. Uh, we need to eventually come out with four of these. That's because we have eight titanium glass and four of these make four of these per second. That's going to be 48 assemblers, which is just redonkulous. Is there a better recipe for this eventually or no? Probably not. Uh, we have 13, so we're going to need to go get some more. And, yeah. Here. And I might as well just keep making stuff over here, I think. Although maybe I should do... this differently. How should I do this differently? What if I put it where there's like 24 on each side? Let's move this. Uh, let's just make it a regular power pole, like right over here someplace. Actually, I don't even need it anymore. Never mind. They're cross-connecting. It's fine. So, if I did that, if I like started here-ish, And we did, well, I guess I don't need to do this, but if I did this, that's because these things take 12 seconds. Holy crap. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. Eleven, twelve. Then we put in a tower. Uh, maybe right there. And then we start all over again. Oops. Hey, I clicked that. Don't give me that crap. I think that'll work, though. Uh, and for this, we need to have two in and one out. Um, what are the numbers on these? Okay, so the... Uh, doesn't really matter, I guess, but the titanium glass can be on the outsides. So we'll have... Uh, I guess we should set this up. Pink crystals, titanium glass, and we're outputting plain filters. Just for fun, we'll go ahead and put warpers in here too. Wait, were these the ones that we were gonna 
Yeah, these are the ones we're going to ship. Okay. Yeah, I'm not doing full belts because I'm not that crazy. So these are the items we're actually going to be shipping off planet. So this definitely needed to be a station. Let's do um, let's do pink stuff here. And then we'll do uh, the output belt here. Copy one of these over. Nobody. I'm calling nobody crazy. Clearly. I don't call people crazy. Who don't deserve it. Okay, this goes there then. Actually, it doesn't need to go that far, even. And then this one also comes out here with the uh, titanium glass. I just simply don't have the time for a massive build like that. I mean, as is, we're still poking through this game weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks later, so. Input there, input there. Output there, input there. Output there, input there. Okay, now I can delete all these. Reset them all. poles. Every set of eight gets a power pole. Well, every set of four, I guess, gets a power pole. And then we need one here also. Okay, so let's uh, start up this half. Uh, remote storage, local demand, local demand, and then those are supplying. And then we can start up, we can start working on the second half. So, this first one, I guess I can do this part first. I'm not going to set these filters yet, just because I don't want these belts filling up. Do that one there. We'll just mirror this whole setup. So, do uh, pink stuff here. And I just ran out of Mark III belts. What are we doing on Mark III sorters? Probably going to need some. Oh, yes. All of those. And all of those. Okay. You keep going this way, then. Likewise, for you... And for you. And then we have our input belt this way. I think I will give it the same amount of space-ish. Wait a minute, I'm gonna mess this up. I did. I think. I can't really tell. 
These sorters are a pain to look at. Okay. This one goes here, I think. Yeah, that makes more logical sense anyway. Oh no, power is suffering. At least I hope that they're not messed up this time. Let's, uh, let's put some power down and double check. And then we can see the arrows. Okay, yes, they are correct this time. One, two, three... How bad is power now? Holy crap! We're gonna have to fix that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine... Ten... Eleven... Twelve... because these things are charging. Well, then I don't have enough power being made. Two, three. Ha! Nice phasing. That's a little spastic, but that's fine. We'll just make more mess out of it. And then the pink crystals go here. Okay, now let's go see what's going on with the power. No, we're not getting any stuff in here. That's what's going on with power. Because this one's demanding it all. Let's make, make this down a little bit. And give me some of these. Give me some power. Power. Alright, that's better. I forget with these dishes. Yeah, we can have more dishes too. So we should set up some more of them. Probably in the pole though. So, uh, we're just a little exceeding the power now. Not nearly as bad. We could make some more of these fusion thingies, which might not be a bad plan. Bright purple light. How many more of these can I make right offhand? I can add four more easily enough. Curvature of the planet. That's better anyway. I have a few. Okay. Now we're doing better. So now we have lots of these things being made. Maybe. The pink crystals are a little suffery. Why is that? Because I'm making enough. 16 of those. To... 20 of these. 
to 48 of these. I don't understand why that is such a problem. They're crafting at full speed. We should be making four per second. Let's go into the stats here. Now, if only I could search for this, that would be useful. We're not making four per second. We're making like less than no, that's consumption. Why are we only making 75 per minute? Each of these makes one every four seconds. We have 16. Half of them aren't producing. Oh, crap. This sorter is not going belt to machine. It's going machine to machine. Uh, yeah, be careful when you do that. All right, that should help matters slightly. What's your problem? Not any graphene. How are you not picking up the graphene? You're literally looking at it right there. Um, sort of has graphene in his inventory. Why are these not picking up graphene? Oh, it has the pink crystals in its inventory still, I bet. Doggone it. Because I put them down the wrong belt. Yep. I just need to do that. Go away, thing. That one's already working. That one's not. Okay. I might be straightened out now. some of those off there. It's called... Um, it's called Copy Inserters. Um, and welcome, by the way, Trunks. Thank you for the, thank you for the pointer there. Um, it's called Copy Inserters. Um, I have a tutorial on my YouTube channel um, that shows you how to, uh, how to set it up. And, um, you can get yourself going for it. Works really well. What's missing here? Oh, the pink crystals, of course. Nine days straight. That's a, that's a good number. Caledorn did that for a while there. Alright, so these hopefully are now producing... 240 per minute. Perfect. I don't know why our consumption's only 144, though. But whatever. It's weird. But I think... Yeah. Copy inserters was buggy for a little while. Um, and then at some point, they figured out the bugs and fixed it. And now it's the best thing since sliced cheese. So I don't know why we're not using all of the pink crystals, because we should be. I guess it's going up slowly. Yeah, it's just a, because it's a one minute average, so we're just going up slowly as we get nearer to that first full minute after I fix the thing. And then, so we should be producing... Oh yeah, then I would go with, I would go with bread as well. 
or even like something else entirely. Okay, let's do... Where is the titanium glass thingy, or the plane filters? 180, okay, this is going up. This should come up to 240. Yeah, this should get to 240 as well. Sliced peanut butter. Yes, that is it. Uh, that should get up to 240 as well, and then the uh, titanium glass should be 480, and it is. So I think that Turkish Delight, that's an option too. I think we're going to end for tonight. So, um, as I mentioned earlier, Slice gluten-free bread? Yeah, we could do that, I suppose. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, twice, um, uh, re rescheduled this week. No stream on Thursday. Uh, makeup stream on Friday. Possibly no stream, or at least a shorter stream on Saturday. And that should, um, that should do it. A surprise in the stream, hopefully, on Friday. So tune in for that. It'll be the usual time, 9.30 Eastern. Now it's daylight savings time. And uh, we will uh, find someone to raid. Who do we want to raid? Who do we want to raid? I don't see anybody that I know who is live. So let's just find somebody who might be playing Dyson Sphere to raid. Let's see, let's, um... Let's raid this person at random. I can't tell what who they are because... Well, um... Oh! There you go. Dibidlybop. Okay, good. You're lucky I caught it. All right, he's playing RimWorld. Okay, so let's. Uh, there, you, you got to use some of your some of your coins there, there, Caladorn. Good, good to your meteorites. Good job. All right, so thanks everyone for coming tonight, and uh, uh, thank you, Future Boy. Uh, you sleep to, you sleep well as well. Uh, next time we'll come in and we'll take we'll pick up from here on the other planet with these uh, these um, plane filters and work our way into green science, and then uh, we'll start doing some more research. So you guys have a good night, and I will see you all on Friday. Bye for now.